Warning, this video contains mature content. The following responses do not reflect the actual views of the individuals playing. It's just an immature game played for fun. In Birth by Sleep, Ven's story was definitely the weakest, just blindly running around looking for a baloney pocket. <laughs> okay. <laughs> looking for penis. <laughs> just blindly penis, running around looking penis, for a penis, 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 penis. Or, no, I guess a baloney pocket, that would be what the penis goes into. Okay. <laughs> Never mind. He's baloney in his slacks. He's looking for pussy. <laughs> Is that anybody? I was a porky pig in that one cartoon. Yeah, play it, it, you penis kick, get, get, get a pussy. Uh, pet. I still say if Disney ever buys out one of ours, they need to make us, uh, like a short mini series of porky singing your favorite Disney songs. <laughs> <laughs> Just a wee 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 whistle while you wee 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 work. <laughs> <laughs> when you wee wee wish upon a sissy star. She's <laughs> 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 a super kicky cow for. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Admit it, that would be fun to watch. <laughs> Just yeah, him struggling was... to sing Disney songs. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be hilarious. Oh, this is a e e e e e e night. That's a beautiful. <laughs> and they call it. Be 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 be. <laughs> In the Lion Kingdom, blank is the best way to assert your dominance. Crump is the best way to assert your dominance. I'll crump with you, sweetie. <laughs> Or Donkey Kong. <laughs> yeah, in the Lion Kingdom, an ape is the best way to assert your dominance. Taking down an ape. <laughs> <laughs> so, what's the thing Barry most likes about Conker? Just the one about the hell she's using him. Mm. Such a cute couple, despite the. He makes her laugh. Ah! <laughs> oh, wait a minute! A oh, very funny, very funny girlfriend. So does my husband. You little bitch. <laughs> Cat fight. Yeah! <laughs> Tom foolery. Or one of the things, like inside a thing or another, whatever you know. One of the things Say that goes like. Voice. <laughs> one of the things that goes like in the thing or whatever, you know. <laughs> Wait, yeah, you know what I mean. Um, I've got a personal. Oh my. <laughs> I don't know why, but just for last, I'm gonna read this on like their Charles Martinet voices. But uh... you bring an unnecessary amount of drugs? No. <laughs> you bring a Boston Terrier? No! A <laughs> Boston Terrier? <laughs> we're gonna bring a little dog. Uh, let's see. An extra ingredient to the concoction. A chimp named Ray Ray. <laughs> a chimp uh... named Mojo Jojo. <laughs> <laughs> or Square Enix. <laughs> what? Well, I'll go for the chimp. <laughs> so, my friends and I suppose we're never play Mario Party again. Not after the accident. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Professor. I was an accident, too. Or <laughs> Daisy Cruises. Daisy's nickname for Luigi. L Luigi. Lucy? <laughs> Luigi, sorry. Uh, Daisy. <laughs> Damn you, Daisy. I, I like the accident because it, it just sounds like it's too horrible to mention. Not after oh, the accident. Don't worry, Mario. I was an accident, too. My, ga my guidance counselor suggests I pursue a career in Bugs Bunny Square Dance. <laughs> a career in nabbing nab nuts nuts. Oh my! Got oh, that one short Bugs Bunny. I remember you mentioned that on the radio at some point, that one song he was singing. Yeah, um, there was once, um, like, a, we're ha like, we had a tri-state rodeo is what it's called, and uh, in honor of that, they played Bugs Bunny Square Dance on the radio, just for, <laughs> just the clip from the episode, so you even heard, like, the sound effects of all the hits. It's, it's, it's brilliant. So it's, it's, like, it's like, I don't even like the rodeo, but I'm glad I tuned into that. That was funny. <laughs> I would have I would laughed my head off if that happened. I think that's hilarious. A bird in the hand is worth Morgana McCobber. She's a bird. A bird in the hand is worth cows overhead. I don't know why, I like how that alliterates. So, what's his new superpower? It's quiet. Too quiet breath. Or, oh, banana breath. <laughs> <laughs> oh, banana. Oh, uh, I could have used banana breath for this one. <laughs> I barfed so, out bananas. I'm vomiting on the bunk. Conker said, she's gross. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> or or to one particular one cock said three individual hairs. On or his Homer tongue. Simpson. On his tongue. <laughs> <laughs> on his tongue. Oh god no. Ah, uh, no it's not. It's just an itty bitty hand job for Freddy Krueger. <laughs> No, it's not. It's just an itty bitty jackhammer. <laughs> Damn, or guy, you kinky whore. She would, she would be into that. Oh my. Duck, duck is crushed now, poor baby. <laughs> now he's been shot. <laughs> he killed himself. <laughs> he shot himself. Well, it's still take one more step and I'll smash balls. <laughs> <laughs> Hold still, take one more step, and I'm going to Disney Wang. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid going to Disney Oh boy, Disney <laughs> Is that like a contract negotiation? <laughs> I don't care who I work for, I'm going to Disney <laughs> <laughs> Or it's like, take one more step, and I'm switching over to Disney. You get to find more rabbits to shoot, then. Oh my god, so, um, oh Gary K. Wolf. Oh boy, Roger Rabbit, Judy Hart. <laughs> yeah, somebody, uh, Gary K. Wolf posted a picture of Roger Rabbit and um, Judy Hopps giving it to the hug. <laughs> boy, a rabbit. Oh wait, he doesn't go here anymore. <laughs> the March Hare. The, the White Rabbit. Oh yeah. Oh god. Thumper. No. Thumper's <laughs> girlfriend, whatever her name was. <laughs> She's dead meat now. <laughs> my... Genitals are nicknamed Lanky Kong, Stretchy Orange Cock, and an Audi Pussy, or the Hive and the Wildest Ride in the West. <laughs> <laughs> what the bloody hell, guys? Jesus <laughs> it's like calling them Pixie and Dixie, and I'll get away with it. <laughs> I used to love Pixie and Dixie. <laughs> Mises. The best Final Fantasy cameo in Kingdom Hearts has got to be Aqua cartwheeling on your balls. And- well, she's definitely more of a Final Fantasy character than a Disney character, although she is Kingdom Hearts exclusive. But um, <laughs> best Final Fantasy cameo in Kingdom Hearts has got to be the depression I got from Birth by Sleep story. <laughs> <laughs> well, both are Kingdom Hearts related, but since Aqua's more of a character, I guess. But and both were Birth by Sleep related, funny enough. But. Can't really call her a cameo though if she is introduced in that series through that. But. <laughs> You don't you don't watch a Mickey Mouse cartoon, see Mickey show up in his own cartoon, and say that's a cameo. <laughs> it's only a cameo if he shows up in another Disney property. <laughs> yeah. That thing requires me to be shirtless. What do you mean that thing? Mm. A paper cut across the nipples requires me to be shirtless. Yeah, that's a fucking examine the poor bastard. Yeah. Ow, shit. That thing. Ancient Neanderthals used to be aroused by Professor Oak having sex with a Pokemon. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> The sight of your favorite restaurant burning down. <laughs> yeah, when they discovered fire for the first time. <laughs> what, the Krusty Krab burned down? So, when I hear Simple Minds sing, Don't you forget about Blaze, the cat's purple pussy. Don't you forget about Fenton. <laughs> oh, boy. And his blathering blather skite. <laughs> Please stop pestering me about that fucking Tooth and Trailer for Banjo 3, bastards. <laughs> or weedle and weedle anal beads. <laughs> <laughs> Twinkle Bark, it says a, se- well, a cute severed hand's getting free, and then she cuts off Sonic's hand. <laughs> God. Twinkle Bark, it says cute duck's getting free. Aww. <laughs> So, uh, beating the dynamite has to find a date, then. <laughs> Saving the world before blowing loads so hard homicides happen. What? <laughs> Saving the world before crying helplessly like a tiny child. Bubbles. Bubbles. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I remember once seeing a YouTube poop where uh, SpongeBob was asking kids, uh, you kids like bubbles? And they shout, no! And then you see bubbles crying in the background. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh she's so adorable. <laughs> Sir, you've been tested positive for suicidal ideation. <laughs> or tested positive for madness, starving, hysterical. <laughs> oh, shit. God help Captain Magma. <laughs> 
<laughs> Neptune helped Captain Magma. <laughs> God help when the father blessed Mary with his hard throbbing cock. <laughs> oh, dear. You do. Joseph, what did you put that? I'm a virgin. Says you. <laughs> <laughs> So, in the early 1900s, people would regularly obtain medicine by the age of 17. <laughs> yeah. Kid, you're 17 now. Here's your medicine. That's all you get for the rest of your life. Or a good bioweekly <laughs> Jesus Christ. I mean, eh, it's the time period, I guess. Jesus Christ. Goigle, goigle. Weirdly, this seems more appropriate for the time period. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry for that one. <laughs> goigle, goigle. Goigle, goigle, indeed. Lamp oil, rope, jagglings, it's yours, my friend, as long as you have enough fingers. <laughs> Lamp oil, rope, another bug hunt, it's yours, my friend, as long as you have enough, you'll be sorry! <laughs> <laughs> I'll go. I don't know. I kind of like as long as you have enough fingers. I don't know why it's kind of funny. <laughs> Welcome to the salty spittoon. How tough are you? The decision should just say fuck it and walk away. Huh? Uh, that's pretty tough. Like Vivian on the young ones, just fucking sticks his fingers up and leaves. Yeah. All right, shrimp flavored jelly beans. Oh, get right in. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to go with the first one. <laughs> well, I think Jared Gillis couldn't. Invent an android with all its parts. <laughs> or the patriarchy bitches. I don't know, I thought there was something funny about him. You know, he can never build something with everything that was meant to be included. <laughs> the smart kids are friends, not food. <laughs> Spellcasting kids are friends, not food. So, Pooh got stuck in a coat hanger again. <laughs> Pooh got stuck in Charles being a bottom again. <laughs> so things like I mean, orgasm, triple dice and gacha games, or singing Super Mario World Leaves and Toadette. <laughs> what the fucking hell? I'm terrified. So gambling attention. turns you on? <laughs> no. No, that shit does. In the future, all doctors will be replaced with rocket surgery. <laughs> We'll be replaced with Wario! Dr. Wario! <laughs> so Dr. Mario is obsolete now. Oh, man. Like, both of these could work, but I don't see how surgery replaces a doctor. But <laughs> I can have a proof of picture to a drawing of Conquer and Princess Rapunzel and a frying pan fight to the death. Oh, my God. Or a Xenomorph. That's probably me. The name of my sex tape is Christopher Walken as Wonder Woman. <laughs> Hello. Someone who needs to just spit it out already. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Angel, wake up now. Get outside. There's velocitards. <laughs> or there's a group of casually racist crows. <laughs> Wrong film. I guess I'll go for velocitards. Yes. <laughs> Finally, one of my robot chicken answers popped up. Fuck uh, you. Have you, ever uh, seen, have you ever seen that one about, like, uh, from Jurassic Park? Uh, like, uh, the hunter mentions how, like, um, uh, be careful, these uh, raptors are very well trained. And then all of a sudden, it shows, like, a, a gay stereotype raptor, and he's, like, uh, training all the other raptors to um, dance in formation. And uh, then uh, he's, like, har harshly criticizing them. Then one of them, like, mentions, like, why are you so mean? He's like, oh, I mean, good one, Crystal. Slow clap. <laughs> Clever girl. From the top, Velocitards. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a pretty funny skit. <laughs> Making love to the person reading this card is like having Michael J. Fox take the urinal next to you and realizing it was a bad aid with sandals, <laughs> or killing the mayor of Hedgehog with a mouse mousetrap. <laughs> oh. What the fuck? <laughs> he was a dick. <laughs> Hedgehog Village, what the hell's that? Uh, from Sonic oh. Boom. So the mayor, from, because remember, um, there's that one episode uh, where it, they discovered their town had no name, and in the end, um, since uh, Six was proven to be like a, her ancestor was like a founder of the place, uh, she was given the privilege of naming it, and she named it Hedgehog Village after her best friend Amy the Hedgehog. So. Aww. Mm. Aww. Hedgehogs. Those little shits crawling about then, snuffling around, little noses twitching. <laughs> 
Grunty's band, Grunty and blank. Grunty's band, Grunty and Sanic. <laughs> Grunty and the brutal, ruthless reign of Bernard Sanders. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> so, I keep asking myself, would the will to get out of bed make it any better? <laughs> Ooh, I feel that one. Would the cookie make it any better? <laughs> I also feel that one. Damn. Oh, the first one, though. <laughs> Post, but would washing go down the hole? <laughs> Stuff with many would her better go down the hole. You need to sit here and think about baby Looney Tunes porn. No thanks. No, I don't. <laughs> you need to sit here and think about ranting on about your darkness, hearts, and keyblade fetishes. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that, Abu. It's not every day you see a horse playing Don't Fear the Reaper at full volume outside the Suicide Prevention Resource Center. Jesus. Or it's not every day you see a horse with a pair of balls like California raisins. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> stunning, stunning the blind man because he'll never see it coming. The perfect <laughs> Or I'll just be rest of the position with intent to sell. The perfect crime. <laughs> well, what you expect in my dream of getting really high with George Harrison? A happy ending? <laughs> well, what you expect in Conker's Bad Fur Day? A happy ending? I honestly was thinking that in the back of my head. <laughs> There's nothing quite like a good smack on the ass. <laughs> As nothing quite like a good platonic cervical massage. Oh, God. Uh, go for the first one. <laughs> SpongeBob learned how to fly when he invented inflatable tramp stamps. <laughs> or inflatable tits. <laughs> uh, those are already a thing. Let's go for tramp stamp. Nothing <laughs> says true love quite like. Beating your friends up with a wooden sword. <laughs> or Pocahontas taking a tomahawk to John Smith's head. <laughs> you want to succeed? Avoid Lady Gaga's take at all costs. <laughs> yeah, or avoid Lady Gaga at all costs. Or avoid skull fucking a jack o' lantern. <laughs> well. <laughs> I know how much you hate her, so I thought maybe I'll stand her. After today, I'm dropping villagers into a grinder. <laughs> After today, I'm eating while pooping. <laughs> I'm gonna sit on my butt. <laughs> I need to watch that film again. Oh my god. Forcing your lover to call you on the phone while you're having a shower. <laughs> Forcing your lover to call you daddy. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Oh boy! It's like have you ever heard that joke where um, uh, a girl's having dinner with her dad and her boyfriend? She says, "Daddy, can you pass the salt?" Both the dad and the boyfriend read for the salt. <laughs> <laughs> I've got it. Let's get here. <laughs> Let's get laid. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad none of you got predictable and said dangerous because I'll be like, "Oh, fuck off." <laughs> he can shove it up his ass. Conker, yes you boy. You're an Onga Bunga shitting his loincloth. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he got reincarnated. <laughs> Conker, yes you boy. You're a naked hairy beast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. So Barry used to call me. And that's what I called her too. <laughs> <laughs> Sexy squirrels always need a sex. I wonder who wrote that. Hmm. Another shit post always needs a sex. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> Motan was amazed by Banjo's fingering skills. <laughs> what? What? I play the banjo, get it? Fingering. Motan was amazed by Banjo's lack of GameCube skills. <laughs> oh, you bastard. <laughs> oh, yeah. Zoe, stop trolling the game. Yeah, Banjo practices fingering every day. I would admit, I would compliment you on your GameCube skills, but that's right, you weren't on it. <laughs> Piss off. Although he should have been. You know. Roses are red, violets are flowers, stupid. <laughs> violets are ass. <laughs> <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> so what was what was under Big Al's left foot? Or most Europeans. Basically, stepped on Kazooie. Oh, the stuck on the birdie. So Disney presents bed knobs and ball sacks. <laughs> or bed knobs and bob arms. Oh. <laughs> little Disney Nintendo crossover. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'll go with that. Yeah! So, Bugs Bunny was headed to Pismo Beach, but ended up in looking up Peach's skirt. Pismo <laughs> Beach. Oh my god, a little bastard! Or ended up in Westy eating your pussy. Oh god, this is a hard one. <laughs> Oreo and Waluigi. New Alka Seltzer roofies. <laughs> <laughs> Oreo and Waluigi, the War of 1812. <laughs> <laughs> Does it when the 1812 Overture starts playing? <laughs> Complete with cannons. Shit, I left Metal Harbor in the baby. Da -da 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 -da. I left a microwave in the baby. Or did you leave a baby in the microwave? Uh, either would be awful. <laughs> Peter, what's doing? Ah, crap, Lois, I left a microwave in the baby. <laughs> Stewie comes out with like a square shaped belly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think this is very d digestible, do you? <laughs> it's like top going through your cage with a hula hoop for plants. <laughs> oh, fluffy puppies! <laughs> Close enough. Instead of fluffy cushions. <laughs> I now pronounce you man and blank. You may kiss my ass. <laughs> I now pronounce you man and a very fuckable face. <laughs> I now pronounce you man and drunk pregnant woman. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> Sorry. There's no way of explaining the morning after pills to your mother. <laughs> or there's no way of explaining hackers hacking stuff to your mother. Mother's like, believe me, I already know. <laughs> <laughs> Prince Eric wanks to licking cheese chowder off Gadget's mousy tits. You <laughs> sick bastard! Prince Eric wanks to the term raw dogging. <laughs> uh, that's still Disney. <laughs> you bastard. So Sonic has plans to avoid Amy's affection, a brain chip that suppresses horniness. <laughs> or suicide! Oh jeez. You sick bastard Sonic. A bit drastic. <laughs> So next year, Disneyland plans to erect a 50-foot statue to commemorate. Oh, if only I still have the licky cheese chowder off gadget. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> a 50-foot statue to commemorate Bugs Bunny. Yeah, thanks Disney. <laughs> or to commemorate Gravity Falls. Oh shit. There's the Gravity Falls, I guess. <laughs> Hello, I'd like to play a game. You only have 60 seconds to escape your chains with tank getting tanked. You only have 60 seconds to escape your chains with mature ejaculation. <laughs> that was what I was going to use for the statue because erect was used in the word. So erect uh, ejaculation. Uh, but I ended up putting up, typing in Bugs Bunny because I'm a dickhead. I thought Bugs Bunny was funnier, honestly, because it's like, um, uh, you know, uh, building a statue of your greatest rival, basically. <laughs> yeah, Bugs Bunny and Mickey Mouse is. <laughs> Somewhere Mickey Mouse is, is done with Bugs Bunny's ears. <laughs> and buck teeth. At this rate, Disney needs to buy out Warner Bros. and save him from their misery. <laughs> yes, please. Alright. He secretly loved to paint shit. <laughs> or vampire chickens. <laughs> sure, let's go with those. <laughs> oh, come on! He loved to paint shit! Today we're painting a little toilet, and here we're going to paint a happy little shit. <laughs> Time to kink shame. I've had it with the bio lizard <clears throat> shoving the space colony arc up his ass. It's downright disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> I've had it with forcing a fart. It's downright disgusting. Yeah, it is a gross kink, honestly. No who... shitting yourself, Billy! <laughs> Have you ever been on Davian Art and saw, like, sick fetish arts of uh, beloved characters farting? It's gross. <laughs> pisses me off. I guess so, yeah. Fuck you, Davian Art. Country road, take me home to the place where I belong. But 
Martha Junior, Martha Mama, take me home. Kill me. <laughs> <laughs> take me home. Deep inside your asshole. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm never gonna listen to what I'm never gonna watch Whisper of the Heart the same way again. Watch the Shuku. Alright, you invertebrates, I'm gonna show you how to do the snare. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to do Jack Skellington's bony boner. Get off! Yeah. What's this? <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's Skellington, I guess. Oh come on, but he has a vertebrate. Snare was a, a plant from Cambio, he had no bones. <laughs> oh, uh, I haven't played Cameo. Oh, it's so good. Need to play it again. He, he was like a giant green uh, plant monster. He ate things and spat them out. Um, he could fling uh, them. Like, he, he could, like, uh, pull his neck back and, like, fling them by using the control uh, stick, basically. Like, you fling the control good. stick to... It was a cool control method. <laughs> uh, oh, no. Not blank. Not that. Oh, no. Not the measles. Not the measles. Not the sensation of getting sandblasted at your gum. Not that! <laughs> Not happy birthday! <laughs> so, the ghost of Fat Bastard from Austin Powers is haunting my toilets. <laughs> or the ghost of Air Bud. <laughs> Poor dog. He's trying to shoot hoops in the toilet. <laughs> I was trying to drink from the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> that works. Yeah, let's go for Air Bud. Trust Disney had turned Jaws into a musical. <laughs> Small you son of a bitch. <laughs> We're going to eat a bigger boat. Trust Where's Disney had turned. Where's my fucking dinner? I'm going to get any fan. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Trust Disney had turned the love of eating pussy into a musical. I like cats. I like to eat them. The most terrifying Disney creation is Jafar's phenomenal cosmic power compensating for his own impotence. <laughs> or making Turtle Goofy into Turtle Soup. In Kingdom Hearts, when you go to Ariel's world, uh, Goofy's a sea turtle. Figured. Yeah. It's like, yeah, well, Goofy. Yeah. What was Donald again? An octopus. Kind of like Ursula, because oh, that... he just had a bottom half of an octopus. Oh, yeah. And of course, you've got Merman. Um, Mer Mersora. Mm, except his tail fin looked like a dolphin's. So, what kind of latest culinary masterpiece? My voice do it right the first time. <laughs> what? Or Lord of Oh my god! <laughs> That's brilliant! <laughs> this wasn't Goslin. People are always shocked when I tell them about my passion for a turnbog dress as the fairy on the Christmas tree. <laughs> what? <laughs> People are always shocked when I tell them about my passion for conquer. <laughs> turnbog dress as the fairy on the Christmas tree. What the hell? The an awesome Christmas tree ornament ever on the tree. Instead of the star or fairy, we've got turnbog. In a dress. Turn a bug in a dress. In a fairy. Well, in a, it sounds more like he's in like an angel gown, not a fairy gown. But <laughs> shut up, fairy. Come out of your bricks. Girls are banned from crime fighting because of someone starting. A, someone started a fire. What <laughs> up, girls? What up? Or because initiating a foursome with three stooges. Or like a sixsome. <laughs> yeah, yikes. They're a bit young for that. <laughs> Go starting a fire. Girls! <laughs> Speaking of the Powerpuff Girls, help me catch my blank! Help me catch Eeyore! <laughs> help me catch my dog! Help me catch my donkey! <laughs> help me catch the body you said floating down the river! <laughs> I almost uh, used Eeyore for that one about like the most terrifying, the most terrifying thing Disney's ever created. But <laughs> I, thought yeah, Eeyore. I, thought, I thought Jafar would have been more suitable though. I thought Eeyore, Eeyore would have been funny though. Eeyore because he makes an ass of himself. <laughs> Bow down to me, king of yet another Death Star, Palpatine. <laughs> I didn't mean a Death Star. <laughs> Bow down to me, king of the kit, the king of kit, Baloo. Well, <laughs> 
I want to die doing what I love. Doping your bitch with heroin every time she blows you. Jesus. <laughs> Falling out of a window. <laughs> <laughs> I love falling out of a window. Gives me a rush. <laughs> Go see Billy from Wrinkly. Go see Billy from Break Cancer. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! I had so many good, so many good answers. Freddy Krueger's answer. I could have used it earlier. 